Hi, I'm Tina O'Dwyer, founder of The Tourism Space. It seems that the questions of around sustainable tourism and regenerative tourism have become more important than ever as we've continued to progress through the pandemic. As we think about uh, revitalising the industry and things opening back up again, the mood seems to be around change and around possibly looking at alternative and better ways of building the industry back. However, before we can change behaviour or strategies, we really need to change mindset. That's kind of a universal truth. And the mindset we have or that has prevailed for a long time in tourism is like a conveyor belt approach where the visitors come in at one end and all along the conveyor belt they yield up value to the host destination. They hopefully leave at the other end delighted and satisfied, recommending the place to others and possibly returning themselves. And the model has worked reasonably all right for quite a long period of time. But we have seen in recent years how, you know, some, some I suppose, challenges have emerged from that model. In this article, I suggest an alternative paradigm that I call the Super Six for better tourism business. And it's a paradigm that offers an alternative way of looking at destination development and how destinations might build out from here. I believe it's a paradigm worth considering because I believe the way we measure success in tourism in the future will change. We will see a move away from the value, revenue, visitor satisfaction paradigm and towards other considerations like the extent to which tourism benefits communities, protects places, champions cultures and does right by the planet. The Super Six has been derived from really extensive research that I've been lucky enough to carry out over the last decade as well as extensive implementation of that research and testing and trying different models. This Super Six has been used as a starting point for destinations that I've worked with to really work out what a better form of tourism looks like for them. This is the first in a series of six articles on this topic of the Super Six of Better Tourism Business. In the articles, I'm going to explore things like what the paradigm means, what it suggests for us, how it can be used by destination management organizations, how it could be applied by a business, the types of phases you would have to go through in order to implement it, and also how you might secure stakeholder engagement, and all importantly, understand inside the mind of the sustainably minded visitor. I'm looking forward to sharing that with you over the next few weeks and I'd really love to hear any comments or observations you have on this topic. Thank you.